Hey guys, I'm Rival. Welcome back to the channel. So I got flowing out to the WWE 2K24 Community Day, as you can see on the hoodie here. So here in the video, I'm going to show you my experience, my trip to the beautiful state of Utah. Inside of this video, I got clips of the new game. I got clips of some people I played with. Very, very cool. And at the very end, we did get to go to SmackDown, so I have some entrances set up at the end of the video. It was an awesome trip, man. I actually just got done editing this video. Um, very cool video. It's a very cool video to look back on, so I hope you guys enjoy. Yeah, I told you guys, I am taking you all the way there, from the Uber to the airport to the airport to the hotel to check-in. You'll see. You'll see. So I hopped on the private jet. I am leaving Las Vegas. I say smell you later, Las Vegas. Take a look at that view there. We are then above Utah. Take a look at those mountains. We're here to play the new game. I was only in the air for 56 and a half minutes. How cool is that? In all 56 and a half of those minutes, I played WWE Supercard. Phenomenal game. Check it out. I then arrive on my private jet. And guess what, chat? I have a driver waiting for me. That is true VIP. That is true VIP. We then hop in the Lambo. We're going to the hotel. Take a look at those mountains. Again, man, Utah's just really, really freaking nice. It's really nice. So once we arrive there, of course, I slide the driver a 20. I am now checked into my hotel. Not a bad looking room, actually. Take a look at the room. Take a look at the bathroom. Not too shabby. And hey, how about the free water they left for me? Shout out to that hotel. I then checked in. I got some cool gear. I guess they call it swag. I then ordered myself some Wingstop because Hot Honey Rub is back. After three hours of sleep, yeah, three hours, I made my way to the event. The event was looking sick. And then the fun part happened, man. We got to play WWE 2K24 early. We take a look at this screen. I was so excited when I saw this, man. I am a My Faction gamer. Uh, pretty much the reason I was there. Take a look at the 99 overall New Tier Galaxy Opal. Rhea Ripley. So I got to play a lot of the game, man. A lot of these clips you're going to see in, in their own videos. So I got to take a look at the roster. I got to take a look at player models. Take a look at Asuka. We got Angelo Dawkins, Bailey, Becky Lynch. I then got to take a look at a bunch of entrances. This one really exciting. Just like the, the action figure John Cena last year, we get an action figure. Cody Rhodes this year. We take a look at our tribal chief. We take a look at our mommy, Rhea Ripley, with a beautiful looking new title. We take a look at The Rock, who we got to see later on SmackDown. I do have video of that at the end. And also Seth freaking Rollins. I got to do some collaborations with some awesome people, man. <laughs> I don't know about that. Ooh! Did you that, man? Ooh! That was crazy. That's crazy. Ooh. Listen. Ooh. So that's Bash World that's and Small Afro. Video coming soon. A little more exciting here. Sorry, boys. We got to play games with Montez Ford. I'm going to go ahead and post that soon. Here is a quick clip. I do wish I asked a couple more questions. But overall, man, the gameplay was really, really fun. Winning the money in the bank. I see you as a money in the bank. Cash that in. I mean, Priest doesn't know what to do with this. Well, he, he, he don't know what to do. I definitely I know. Do. That's what I'm saying. That ain't going to be no dark or crap for me. Now, this last and final match, I'm going to show you some highlights. Cornell here is EO Sky. I'm digging into the Irish roots. I'm Becky Lynch. I didn't realize how much of a banger this was in the moment. I don't think I think I've just blocked out. I don't remember anything. I was just like so nervous. I was tired. I had all these things going on, man. Just to give you a visual, I had Montez Ford next to me at one point. I had Zelina Vega over here. I had Grayson Waller over here. Xavier Woods over here. We got Drew Gulak taking pictures, putting people in headlocks. Um, this guy's got a million subs. I got Ellie Knight sitting next to me. Uh, I think I just blacked out. So I didn't realize this was that much of a banger until I sat here and watched it. Here it is. Now for the highlights to the banger of a match. We're going to start you off with the back and forth. This is a new feature in WWE 2K24 and just a very, very cool one. Now, listen, I can't sit here and thank these people again. I've done it. 25 million times okay I, i've done it a little too much but what i can say i've been so impressed with the wwe 2k community as a whole and it starts at top with the leaders right cornell's one of them there's a whole team of leaders but cornell is one of them so shout out to him this guy was going around the room just feeling people with motivation confidence everything 
that they need before the game comes out. It's a big year for a lot of us creators, so big shout out to him um, as far as the match goes. Uh, I am a PlayStation gamer. This this is on Xbox, so that's my excuse card here. <laughs> no, Cornell's very good, man. He's a very good gamer. So here are the highlights. Oh, hey, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Her eyes are closed, that means it's over, right? Yes, God! Oh, thank you so much. Uh, appreciate it. No, that was fun. That was fun. Yeah, that's the mission. I had no chance there. Oh, yeah? Nah, don't worry. I can't do anything? You're going to do Becky like that. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and then we got to go to SmackDown. Just a really, really good SmackDown to be at, guys. A lot of Elimination Chamber qualifying matches, and then the show ended with Roman Reigns and The Rock. Check this out. Now, I don't know about you guys, but in this one, I totally thought Dominic was going to win it. Kevin Owens gets the win with the pop-up powerbomb. So this was a qualifying match. Zelina Vega up against Tiffany Stratton. Tiffany Stratton won that. That was a tough one for me. I would have loved to see both of them in the chamber. I did miss out on Tiffany Stratton's entrance. I got a little hungry. Call the cops. Throw me in jail. Do what you got to do. But I got a cheesesteak fry combo with a Budweiser. Oh, yeah. Now, I can't say I'm surprised, but Logan Paul did end up beating The Miz. It was such a weird ending. Uh, wanted The Miz to win, but of course, Logan Paul wins. He actually might kill it in the Elimination Chamber, so it is what it is.
Now this next this next one's special, man. This this next one's special. I got goosebumps. Shoot, I I was close to crying. <laughs> so what? I was. I never saw The Rock live. You know what happened here? I got to see The Rock live. Somebody out there, oh y'all, I've seen him 25 times. I haven't. This was dope. is gonna be it for the video guys i'm up late editing this the chamber comes on in 30 minutes actually so i'm gonna get out of here i hope you guys enjoyed a very different type of video i hope it went well i hope you guys enjoyed it peace out